Good morning, everyone, and welcome back to the alpha version of Cattails here with our young kitten, Mossy, who is very, very quickly learning to grow up and become a fierce fighter and stand on her own four paws when it comes to establishing herself here in the forest colony. And I think we're doing a pretty good job so far, except for the fact that we have a really hard time hunting. We have to kind of like actively chase something because we're not very good at sneaking and that we are basically getting torn to pieces is any time one of the other clans starts invading our territory. Last time we unfortunately lost quite a bit of influence to the mystics, so I'm kind of wondering if we should go on a bit of a reconnaissance mission to learn a little bit more about the mystics so that maybe we'll be able to fight back against them a bit more because they are encroaching on our actual territory quite a bit compared to the areas surrounding the forest colony's territory. And normally I would be the kind of person who quite honestly, it would completely ignore the idea of fighting in territories. But last night, on our way home from visiting the new mines that we discovered, yes, we're totally going to be going in there and collecting some gemstones soon, oh my gosh, we actually got viciously attacked and we could have died! Our health got really, really low and we could have possibly died, except for the fact that Mossy was able to dash into the brambles of the base camp at the last moment. So trying to ignore all all of these battles and just not participating in the fighting or the political influence of each different area at all is not helping us. It's making it much, much more dangerous for us just to try to walk around the forest to find our morning mouse meal, and that is just rude. But all right, so Mossy is trying to figure out how to become a better hunter by befriending Scout. So let's come over and talk to Scout for just a minute. Scout? Huh? Do you need something? It's starting to cool down. Feels like autumn's coming fast. Oh, I totally forgot there are seasons. That's going to be so exciting to see the different seasons go by. Oh my goodness. But um, I think Mossy actually has a little bit of a crush on Scout. And she wants to learn how to sneak better and become a good spy and kind of infiltrate all the different areas. Kind of to show off to him a little bit. But also because it would be politically advantageous and it would give her a secure place within the colony. Which we're learning is pretty important. But let's go ahead. This is a harvest mouse we collected from the mines and let's see if scout maybe likes the harvest mouse we tried giving him a squirrel he was thankful but not super duper excited oh wow i've always loved these thanks a billion mossy oh i'm so glad scout actually likes it can i give you another one uh, uh, maybe I need to eat it first, but I kind of want to give him more. Uh, and I think he, yeah, look, he's coming over here to do some of his sneaking. So we'll do a little sneaking too. Oh, good. And there's some more golden seal. Ugh, Mossy got really, really badly damaged from the battle last time, actually. Not just a little damage. Like, I had to have her sleep for two straight days just so that she would regain enough health that it wasn't, like, mission critical. Ah, get the bird, get the bird, get the bird. Oh, I missed it. Ah, dang it. And I used up my sprint. Oh, but there's a pretty butterfly to make up for it. All right, well, let's go ahead and chase that down. We can put it into our den. But see how Scout is doing his tracking? I just love the idea that we come and we do some of our morning sneaking lessons with him. And I think that Mossy has a definite developing crush on him for sure. All right, we have to be careful with the squirrels because if we don't follow them properly and chase them away, then they'll actually just jump into a tree. Oh, I missed it. I missed it. Get him before he goes in a tree. Oh, I missed him. I'm sorry, Mossy. I should probably level her hunting skill up, but I'm trying to save it up for the diplomacy. All right, I think Mossy's getting a little embarrassed about her hunting levels not being the best uh, right in front of Scout. Oh, okay. Now's the opportunity to show off to Scout what we can do. Yes! <gasps> all right. Um, him. Yeah, that was... We totally can handle that all the time, Scout. Like, that happens all the time. That's not... That wasn't... That wasn't... That wasn't luck. That was the skill that we innately have so we're just gonna go ahead we need to use some of the golden seal again i think that we're still like we might be a little shy have excuses still healing from uh, that that battle we did win one of the two battles at least so maybe that is a point in our favor oh dang it i'm still not very good at birds i think the different hunting levels maybe correspond with helping you with different types of prey like we seem to snag mice pretty well but not so much the rabbits and the birds uh, and mayor how are you doing today greetings stay sharp out there and don't wander too far from the borders have you seen the leaves begin to change they're casting off their verdant robes and donning the traveler's garment what a lovely sight to see 
Mayor, that was even more poetic than usual. He's definitely a deep thinker. All right, let's go ahead and give him a mouse because I feel like we want to be good friends with the mayor. He seems to really care, but it, he almost seems to have kind of like a bleak outlook. So it's like we want to reassure him everything is going to be okay. We'll learn how to take care of the colony. Don't worry, Mayor. All right, let's go ahead and give him the mouse. How did you know that I love these? Thank you so much. This is a great gift, Mossy, and I truly appreciate it. I wonder how often you can give gifts. Maybe just like one gift a day. Oh, there's a butterfly. It went right through my den. All right, hello, little butterfly. Sorry, you can you can rest outside of my den. Or maybe, I mean, eh, I don't like Missy enough to give her my butterfly just yet. Um, who are you and what do you want from me? Sometimes I get caught up thinking about how talented I am. I don't think most cats ever understood what it's like to be so amazing. It's not all fun and games. It's a serious burden. But like I said, I don't expect you to understand. Oh, Missy. All right, we're going to leave Missy be and come over and talk to Ember. Because I'm a little curious. Let's talk to Ember for one thing. Always nice to chat with a valued customer like yourself. Most cats just stop by to buy stuff and then leave. So it's nice that you're sticking around. It gets lonely here sometimes. And actually, I think I'm going to make Ember a girl is what I decided. Sometimes I even talk to my inventory out of boredom. <laughs> All right, I wonder if I could give her anything, but uh, I want to see how much our rare butterfly Ooh, our inventory is kind of full, but our rare butterfly could possibly sell for a muse It is a rare tropical butterfly. Absolutely gorgeous. We're not actually going to sell it Ember. Don't get too excited It is going to make a centerpiece in our little collage that we have going on in our den our den of treasures and fireflies But I was curious how much it would possibly sell for and then three Three? A whole rare butterfly, and you give me three muse for it. I think not, ma'am. However, I will sell the catnip. That, that's okay. I'll sell the catnip. Maybe I'll sell enough of my fireflies that we can go ahead and get 20 muse to double the number of muse we currently have. How much is a harvest mouse worth? Ooh, three muse. Not bad. I uh, happen to know, cough, cough, a uh, good location. Secret, secret, secret hunting location. At least secret to Mossy, <laughs> where we'll be able to get more of those muse. Also, look, we can start leaving some of the marigold around and decorating the camp, which I think is really fantastic. And I'm going to go ahead, get this little butterfly. We could leave the butterfly on this pile of prey. We could make a prey pile over here if we really wanted to. Is this Ember's spot? Ember's den. Inside, you see a messy assortment of items strewn about the ground. Hmm, so it might be fun to like drop some random items around here. All right, we'll leave the marigold over there. I forget what it does. Oh, and let's go ahead. Little butterfly, little butterfly. Sit down, butterfly. Ah! Okay, butterfly got away. And we're gonna drop our super duper rare and super special butterfly right back here in my little treasure pile. I think it's gonna go kind of in the middle because it's currently our top treasure. However, speaking of top treasures, we definitely wanna start collecting things from the mines. So pretty soon we're gonna be investigating the mines. We also have raspberries. Totally forgot we gathered up the raspberries. Definitely wanna start collecting up things from the mines. Just today was more of a healing day because we really, really got hurt. Um, and I do want to investigate and see what's going on around the mystic cat colony. So what do we have left? All right, little harvest mouse. Can I drag items in the inventory? Okay, not yet. That's not something we can do just yet. Oh, hey, come back here, harvest mouse. No, I think I picked up a butterfly instead. All right, yeah, all right. Emperor butterfly, we're gonna drop you right about there. And we're gonna head out. And we're gonna investigate to uh, to our east a little bit so that we can try to learn a little bit about the mountain colony without actually getting in active fights with them. We're not very good fighters. However, we probably could manage to do a little bit of hunting and sneaking. Is there still a battle going on? Why do we get little compass? Oh. Oh, oh, there's a Mew, that's why. Nice, just five little Mews sitting on the ground. Don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I Mew, maybe? <laughs> oh dear. All right, and yes, all right. So we've got a little mouse. Let's go ahead and eat it because we're a little hungry. Nice, I'm so glad that I was told how to use the a little R symbol because it makes things so much easier for being able to go ahead and just slip through what you have in your inventory. All right, let's wiggle down here. I scared off a bird, but I don't see anything else. Also, another suggestion I want to put over on the, the cattails forms is that maybe you can hit trees and like randomly a nest might fall down and you might get an egg to eat or something like that. 
Or maybe random treasures like views or things that the birds may have hidden in their nest. That would be kind of cool. All right, so where are we? I kind of want to look at the map. Okay, I'm going to look at the map just this once. And I kind of want to start training myself not to look at the map too much when we're doing some exploring. So the area to the south and over, especially to the west or the east, excuse me, will be the mystic territory. We happen to have brought with us a lavender though. So if we find a certain area that Mossy really loves as a favorite zone, it'd be kind of cool to uh, drop down. Ooh, look at this. So this is the Delta. It'd be kind of cool to be able to like drop down a lavender and be like, I claim this spot. All right, let's see. Oh, there's some fish. Uh, can we get over there okay? Oh, geez. Swimming's a little hard. And? Nice! Look at the fish! Oh my gosh, you can make things float down the river. That is so cool. Oh, and there's some catnip. Oh, and there's a little firefly. Nice! This is not a bad hunting spot at all. I'll leave the firefly there for illumination. Mm, let's see. What happens if we go this way? And the river mouth. Oh, look, there's some golden seal. Well, we could always use some golden seal. All right, not bad, not bad. As long as we don't slip into one of the currents, I think we're doing okay on swimming. And as long as we don't get caught. Oh, we may not do okay on swimming over there, though. That looks a little bit more serious. <laughs> um. Okay, there's that. I mean, I kind of want to swim out to it, but this seems like it could be risky. Okay, got it. Oh my gosh, look at all the fish, guys! <gasps> if we were fishing cats, we would totally be able to come over here. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Guys, oh no, oh no. Mussy, 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 mussy. Mussy, mussy, oh no. Oh no, oh no, we're gonna drown. Oh my gosh. Mussy, get out of here. Mussy, sprint. Come on. <gasps> ooh, ooh, ooh. Guys, we almost drowned. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, Mossy! Catch your breath! Oh my gosh! Just trying to jump in there after all those big fish. I should have expected it, but I wasn't expecting to be able to like walk down this spot. And we almost got pulled in by the current and almost died. Oh, Mossy, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean for today to, to end your little exploration with almost dying. Is there more golden seal in the area? Here's a little marigold. What does marigold do again? Uh, treats wounds over time. Totally gonna use that. Oh my gosh. I guess we could make a little marigold patch next to Doc and that would be really good to sort of acknowledge like, oh, that's where some of the healing herbs are when we need them. Because, ow, there's a bird. We're, we're wandering around territory that kind of belongs to both cats. It's sort of open right now. But geez, I need more healing herbs. They don't exactly grow abundantly. Look at those fish taunting us. Oh, there's some lavender though. All right, we'll snag this. Wow, that river can be kind of dangerous, guys. Oh, the rumbling overpass. All right, there we go. More golden seal. We can go ahead and use that to help us heal up. Goodness gracious. Well, we've done quite a bit of exploring. How far into enemy territory have we gone? Not even very far. Wow, the world is so much bigger than I realized. All right, wait, 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 and... Yes! All right, we got a frog, too. So let's try eating this frog. Actually, it's hard when we've got lots of things. There we go. So we managed to survive, but I think that definitely would have spooked Mossy. I know it spooked me. Is that a toad? Ah, dang it. It got away. I know that spooked me almost, almost like drowning her. And it's so cool because the prey has definitely changed over here. There's quite a few toads. Oh my gosh, did the season just change? Holy moly, it's autumn! It's autumn! And the fireflies disappeared! <gasps> Wow! There's a dragonfly now! What? Come here! Come here, dragonfly! I wanna... Oh my gosh! There's a brown hawker dragonfly! <gasps> An unusual brown dragonfly that emerges in autumn. It has light yellow streaks along its head and abdomen. Oh my goodness. All right. Well, we stumbled on something kind of cool. Uh, I mean, we almost died, which wasn't so cool. And then, let's see. Valerian energizes cats, but I don't know if it heals us. And I wonder if our season of fireflies is over. I wonder if we don't get to have any more fireflies now that it's this late in, in the season because it's actually changed to autumn. That's so interesting. All right, we'll pick that marigold. 
hate that we have to use so many of them. But another thing, if we work on developing our forging skill, we have over 100 experience. Holy moly, we're going to be able to take that diplomacy skill next time. This is so exciting. But if we upgrade our forging skill, we'll actually start being able to heal up better, get better use out of the herbs we use, including perhaps additional lavender to try to take over some territories. So I'm going to have to remember that too. My gosh, rumbling corner. There's a lot of these rumbling roads that are nearby, um, a lot closer to Mystic Territory. Maybe that's why they're trying to poke their way into Forest Cat Territory. There's a bunny. I want it. Oh, can I get... Oh, so close. No, it outrun me. Of course it would. It's a rabbit. Oh, dear. All right. So maybe that's why we've been having so many unexpected battles with the mystic cats. They live so close to all those rumbling sections. And I guess... Oh, and here's rushing rocks. This is a highly contested area, actually. Let's go ahead and use our lavender in it. So let's look at the map. And this area is currently only 38% controlled by the forest colony, us. So let's see if we can fight back against the mystics by using the lavender. Look at that! And it went up by a whole 11%. Nice! Now it's almost an even split between the two of us. So we'll have to take care of this area again in the future. Now the current, I feel like Mossy is super super nervous about currents because we almost died guys i don't know if she would trust crossing this so she'll go the long way around to find a safer a safer direction to the bridge she's a little bit of a coward cat that way i don't think she likes rain or water as much as i thought but that'll be okay at least we'll keep her alive there we go and there's a little mouse can we grab that for hunting and giving to the mayor? Yes. All right. She's getting better at hunting too. And now there's frogs down here as well. Hmm. All right. Well, I'm going to guide her back into her den. Uh, we'll have to review. Oh my gosh. There's a blue jay. I wonder if it would drop feathers. Dang it. I scared it away. Oh, look. And there's new plants. <gasps> there's blackberries down here. All right. Well, we're going to need to do a proper exploration for the first day of autumn and definitely sort through all of the things we have collected but i need to find a way oh is this a different kind of bird nope just a normal dove yes and we got it all right and i think we've almost got mossy home yeah we've almost got her home wonderful well we didn't die but we nearly drowned and today is the first day of autumn so we definitely need to do a little bit of searching but i have not forgotten that the mole is there and i have not forgotten that all of our adventuring and our exploring in the other territory spots has given us the extremely powerful diplomacy skill which we're gonna say is our spying skill so that we can definitely ramp up our control of the forest colonies territory zones and all of these contested areas very excited about that but all right let's get mossy some rest her little din has changed we've got new treasure and i will see you guys next time bye bye